Hello and welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Team Skywater Rocket League Season Challenge where we forgot what happened last Friday and then the game borked out so either we did great or terrible or medium. Or medium. Or medium. <laughs> Those are all the others. Those are all the others. <laughs> it, turns out, it turns out we did, I think... Medium? Medium. medium. I think we did medium. Let's go. Not oh, bad, man. guys. We're so medium right now. <coughs> Excellent. We are so not extra right now. Right, right. Yes, yes. We are against the Guardians. The we are tied for basically first place in the league. Some would probably say like tied for fifth. I would say tied for first. Right, right. Yeah. This is a weird, a weird season. Like I have a feeling this, this top tier is just going to break away from the bottom tier. And we're gonna have literally just a straight divide across mm -hmm. good teams, mm -hmm. bad teams. And then there's the Express with their lone win against us. Oh, so, no, I geez. remember that happening. So, oh, uh, so uh, just update. Like we said, the Friday episode. Sorry, you didn't get one. Uh, I, we don't know what all would happen with the recording. Mm -hmm. I know, I no idea. It just didn't happen. So we're gonna revisit those questions and. Here we go! Oh man, so now we have experience with these questions. Oh my goodness. Maybe we'll be extra good at answering them. Ooh, Maybe I Maybe we'll be so. extra bad at playing then. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> that is the constant <laughs> conundrum. That is the conundrum. Did we, did we get into any specific arguments about these questions? Hmm, let's find out. I hope so. <laughs> I hope so. I'm up the ball! Hey! Look at that. It is... Oh, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cool. score. I want to see score. Someone shoot! Woo. Yes! Woo. Oh, yes! The ten classic seconds. 15, 10 second <laughs> luck that is Team Scott. Look at this pass. That's great. That was, that was a little really bit good. Of a so that was really good. Boink! It was, almost, win. it was almost like a cat snuggle, you know, was, like the way yes. it like rubs its head yeah. backwards. I nuzzled yeah. that ball to Derek. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> the cat nuzzle pass. I'm just playing a, <laughs> playing a quick game of nuzzle ball. <laughs> Don't mind it is adorable. That's oh! why they call it Nuzzle League. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, where's that game? I'd play that, where you just play no. soccer, but your cats. But your and cats. every now and then the controls just go the wrong direction. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like a great game, by the way. I so, somebody should make it. We'll someone should make that. Yeah, someone should. Yes! Yeah! Yeah! Oh, wow. there we go. You keep on setting them up, I'll keep on dunking them, man. That's yeah. how we do it. Yeah. I'm just in a Nuzzly mood. <laughs> <laughs> the Nuzzly Eagle Shark. That's what I called that pass. The nuzzly yeah. eagle shark. <laughs> All right. Well, so, let's get into some questions. Uh, so this is from our friend, the Baroque Poet. And I know that we've hey. answered some questions from him before. What could this question uh, possibly be? <laughs> um, <laughs> but uh, I think it's very applicable to a bunch of different people. So he says, uh, hey, brothers, DK and Jordan, I'm conflicted on an issue and appreciate your advice. I'm starting my senior year of high school this fall. Because of when my birthday falls, I'll be 18 during the majority of the school year. I want to get a job, but my dad says no. He wants me to focus on my ACT scores. I know my studies oh, are important, but I'm tired of now. being broke. I love your Baroque? Baroque? Really well. Baroque? Oh, I think yep. I made that joke But then you'd week. have to change... Oh, I missed oh, it, y'all. No. I missed it. He's going to have to change his screen name if he's like not Baroque. Yeah. No, I think it's my fault. Look at this. And oh. the miss. Oh, jump. The old miss and whiff oh. and they score. <laughs> the old whiff and they score. I hate that one. That's no good at all. Oh man, I do remember this question, and the answer is I can I've never heard this from a parent ever. That they're like, no, don't get a job. That that doesn't sound like my parents at all. Um, parents no, I don't understand why the two are. Goal! Hey, nice. There it is. Um, I think that uh, you. Well, I mean, okay. Very I don't know. I, don't, so I know it's going great. <laughs> uh, um, yeah. I don't know Advice what sort point. of like time commitments you are already having that your parents feel like you wouldn't be able to do this and have, uh, a, have job. a job. Or like, yeah. you know, that's only like 10 hours a week or something. Like, that's not much time. Oh my gosh. Yep. Oh, oh no, not great, not great, not great. Oh no. Yeah, a lot of after school jobs don't take a whole lot of time. So. They certainly feel like they do. Oh, well, yeah, especially when you're <laughs> in high school. <laughs> when you're in high school. And I think, I think that's oh, what it no. boils down to. Like, I, I am such a huge advocate of of getting real world experience and being exposed to people and working in retail Ooh. in some capacity. Yeah! Oh, yes. Yes. Yeah! There it is. There it is. Yeah. Boom. That felt good. That I felt think that good. it should be a requirement for everyone to work retail at some point in their lives. Just or in a just, restaurant. Just so yeah. they know. Some yeah. sort of customer service thing. <laughs> just yes. so you know. You should have to deal with people. Mm -hmm. um, and I, I think the advice that I gave for this was um, if you are close to 
to an ACT score that's going to get you scholarships at school, then it might be worth putting in the effort to like get get into the classes. No! Sponsor me. Uh, get into the classes or hire a tutor or whatever it is because uh, in college scholarships can be a huge difference in like student loan levels. Oh yeah, and that's totally one of those things where post college student loans oh, affect your life. Oh, it's oh my gosh, um, they totally do. That being said, in my recollection, oh my god, what is guys. happening? How what? did that happen? I was at no part what? of that. What? Which maybe it was by respect the way I got through it, but. It just took oh, and then I just, oh, and then you just oh, redirected wow. it just enough. Oh, that is, oh, gosh, they are, they like, are clogging their way yeah, back they against are, us. They are, they um, are. Um, my recollection was that ACT didn't mean anything, and don't worry about it at all. Don't even take this step. Well, it depends on what job. colleges you're going to. No, yeah. no, really, really no, it doesn't exactly. matter. You know, they don't, no one cares. <laughs> it's a dumb test. <laughs> it's a t Unless you're going to college on the West Coast or in the Midwest, then they don't take SATs at all. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I think, Jay, well, that we may not be qualified to make such um, advice commentary. So. Obvious answer, go to the East Coast. <laughs> <laughs> you know, East Coast I, is the Beast Coast. Midwest that Coast is what they, is they say. <laughs> um, There's no I, I, other better rhyme for the West Coast, I'll tell you that. <laughs> 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 no, no, definitely not. <laughs> not East a really, Coast, uh, Beast Coast. East Coast, Beast Coast, guys. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, I, I'm sure it's changed in the last however long it's been since any of us were applying for colleges, but yeah, I mean, take, take the ACT, take the SAT, do it all. Let me tell you my experience with the ACT, is that I did not, I had never even heard of it. Never even heard of it. I heard about the SAT a lot. One morning, no, one Friday evening, I should say, I am just uh, about to go to bed and my mom's like, oh, hey, FYI, signed you up for the ACTs in the morning. And I'm like, I'm sorry, the what? <laughs> like, like, yeah, it's this, uh, it's like it's like the ACTs, but different. And I'm like, you mean the SATs, what? but different? Yeah, it's like the SATs, um, but um, different. Um. And no! Oh my Gerwin! God, Gerwin! I'm getting so worked up about this ACT story. I know, I know. Um, like, you I, are passionate about this topic. I had no, I, I'm because I'm so mad. I feel like it was such a like, I, it was such a waste of time. I had no idea what it was. I I did very poorly on it because I was like, what? And like, yeah, there there was no prep at all. And then I just felt stupid. And it was like I didn't. I don't think I even listed the scores on like applications because it was like, well, this is. Um, not going to help. It was just a wasted Saturday morning that no one told me about. You know what is so funny about that story, though, is that I had almost an identical experience. So, basically, there was one night where I was being a high schooler and Stop. snuck out of the house and sure. didn't come back until late. Yeah. Um, and so, Mom wakes me up. So, I'm, I go to bed at, like, 3 a.m. Mom <laughs> wakes me up at 6 a.m. And she's like, hey, you need to go take the ACTs. And I'm like... The what? The what? <laughs> no, I do not. <laughs> I don't even know what that is. Act? Am I in acting school? Oh, uh -oh man. someone has got a score. Do right. it. He oh, no! my. oh my gosh. Um, yeah, afraid. and so I was like, someone crossed out. I don't know. I, I think I literally fell asleep in the middle of the exam. That's amazing. Um, <laughs> I think that I got a 25 was my score. That's actually That's not, not bad, bad considering. You were probably half passed out. Yeah. Okay. Well, I didn't know that, guys. I was thinking 25 out of 100, so. It's 25 it's out, out of 36. 36. Oh, okay. <laughs> you know what? I retro you thought it was a percent? <laughs> <laughs> I retroactively feel so much better about things. Yeah. I'm like, man, I did awful. <laughs> yeah, I think, like, um, back when we were in, entering into college, it would have been maybe a uh, between an 18 and a 20 was the average score, and 25 to 28 was college-bound scores, as they yeah. called them. College-bound. College-bound college bound was one of those terms that was like, oh, I no, I, no, no, no. Oh my god. I, I felt like college-bound was a term that just like it's it's the exact right term and branded just so terribly. <laughs> like college-bound classes are just. Very exclusively not AP rough. classes. Like, mm -hmm. that is what a college bound class is. No. Mm -hmm. Not AP or dual. Did you guys have dual classes? We had dual. What is dual? Yeah. Dual was like, are you getting, high, are you you getting, getting college, college credit? credit for the class? Yeah. Not just <gasps> I think in order to get college credit for an AP class, you have to pass the AP exam. Yep, oh, you okay. have to get a certain score on it. 
Um, dual classes, I don't know why you just it's got different, credit for but you just got credit for yep. them. Yeah. Oh. It's easier, and I, I not have you get credit. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I would pretty confidently say that most of the AP classes that I took in high school were harder than all of my early year college classes. I don't think I took any AP classes yes! in high school. Good job. Well done. Well done, guys. So yes. I guess the goal did we get, any assists? Did we give I think I got the goal. Start to talking about the ACTs? Oh, I see. Yeah, we just continued talking about standardized um, tests. Yeah, I guess, I, I don't know. I, I feel like Woo! there's no reason why you shouldn't be able to do both. That's my thought. I agree. Um, hydro. What, uh, what job did you guys have in high school? Oh, man. I was a soccer referee. I was a guitar teacher. Nice. Mm -hmm. I yeah. My first job was a soccer referee, and then my which was not. I don't know. I wouldn't know if I don't know if I would even count it as a job. I mean, <laughs> we made money doing it. We did. We did. Refing yeah. soccer matches is really. It's like you get paid really high for the hour, but the hours are one at a time and randomly scheduled. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like six. I make sixteen dollars an, an hour. hour. Yeah, one three, hour at a time. Three hours a week. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> um, Can I hang out? No, it's definitely scheduled during that time. Right. I don't know what it is, but I can't hang out. Guys, right. it looks like all of the other four two teams oh, just straight oh, lost. Did they? <laughs> all of them, all of them just lost. That's unbelievable. The Express actually won the too. Express well, of course, yeah, they, they must had to have. But I think we've got a, uh, a sponsor message. Uh oh! Ooh. Time for today's sponsor. And today's episode is brought to you by Noah, and his message is in support of his good friend Rain, who just started streaming on Twitch, playing games with friends and with her cute dog Karma. You can find Rain at twitch.tv slash sort of pleasant, and that does sound quite pleasant. Well, I think sort of, sort of unpleasant. I, you oh, know, this is wow. actually going to be Wait, a is it sort of unpleasant. Yeah. Oh, I hold on. Let me redo that. No, can... no, I think we're better this way. <laughs> like now we're discussing it. Oh, okay. This is like lengthy. So it's actually sort of unpleasant how you got that wrong. <laughs> and also twitch.com Twitch.tv backslash <laughs> sort of unpleasant. Hey, we are so good. It was sort of unpleasant how you Man, got it wrong. I'll bet the no is very happy. Derek, do Derek you why don't you give it a whirl? <laughs> this, is, this is money well spent on a sponsor. Well, well actually, what's interesting with this, uh, with uh, Twitch.tv slash sort of unpleasant, uh, I thought that this was going to go up on Friday. Yeah. And I couldn't remember if it had actually gone up or not. And we, I sent sort of unpleasant a raid. Oh. Oh, so, like everybody that was watching me on Twitch. Did uh, you really? That's so cool. Oh, how spectacular. Well, there you go. I hope, well, what was she playing? Was yeah, uh, Dead playing? by Daylight, if I recall. I don't even know what that game is, it's but I'm sure it was great. Game. Oh. Was Karma present? Uh, the, Karma was apparently sleeping. We asked. We specifically asked for Karma. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, no. Well, everybody adorable. be sure when you tune in to ask for Karma. Ask for Karma <laughs> from Rain. Or really, Scott, from Skywater. From Skywater, yeah. Really yeah. is the better. <laughs> The better name for your friend altogether. You should just start calling him that instead. All right, sponsor read over. On with the show. That was like our best sponsor read ever. Probably our best like, sponsor read I'm ever. Really, I really like. I feel yeah, like our, I think everyone right. is sitting back in their chair going, "Well done." <laughs> you boys are good. You guys have. Speaking of Skywater, it seems to be Skywatering right now. Oh, against oh, the rules. Here we go. Here we go. I'm going for the ball. I'm going for it. It's being attacked. It went our way. Uh, who'd have thought? By our way, I mean it went their way, but our way, like, is in terms of, like, near our goal. Oh, no, I understand. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm going to say it went our way every time. And it'll always because make it, sense. Because it's always true. It always makes sense. It's like it, air In Rocket condition. League, the ball is always headed your way. <laughs> 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 that makes so much sense. It's like, it reminds me of it's that It's all a matter of perspective, guys. You just got to look on the bright side of life, you know? <laughs> yeah. Right look on the bright side of Rocket League. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Whoop, All right, so we have a question from Shane D. He says, Shane. Hey, Ben, J, D, K, and Jordan, hey. do you have any recommendations for Netflix shows? I've watched all of the CW shows, just finished a series of unfortunate events, watched all of the Marvel shows on Netflix, 13 Reasons Why, Shooter, and several other things. But do you have any new suggestions? I well, have I a know suggestion. That... Maybe you should get a job. <laughs> <laughs> have you I'm just kidding. Not watching so much TV. <laughs> or, or alternatively, checking out Twitch.tv. <laughs> that is sort, sort of unpleasant. Like sort of they sound like they have a cute dog. <laughs> and Karma. Oh man. Oh, man. Okay. Oh! Fall out of our way. Oh! <laughs> Thanks for the warning, man. <laughs> 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 
Yeah. I, th I thought maybe you guys would be able to uh, <laughs> quickly adapt. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I've watched most of those shows too, so I really have no room to speak. Um, I would say uh, Orange is the New Black is very good. A new season Ooh, yeah. that just came out. Uh, yes, Ben. Oh, wow. Look at that. Way to way to recover. Thanks. Um, also, there's some like older like '90s shows that are very classic that aren't really Netflix specific, but. I think you'll enjoy, like, uh, Friends. Oh, that's so good. Yeah, Friends is really good. Parks and Rec, How I Met Your Mother. Uh, some of these might be on Hulu rather than Netflix, but, you know. I think, I think you're doing pretty good so far. I like yeah. the, sh the TV show Scrubs. Oh, oh man. Yeah. Oh, oh no! Oh, man, I saw that happening. I was like, I can't, I'm, it's going to bounce in a very terrible spot near me. And, yeah, there, okay. Underrated. When it's bouncing over you, it just, yeah. Damn it's like when it. somebody throws a football over the wrong shoulder and it's yeah, just like, no. oh, oh god. I turned the wrong way. Man, that is the worst. Oh. Other other Netflix or, or similar TV shows? I'm trying to think. Uh, I am actually oh, currently score. watching. No, 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 yeah, Shepard again. I think he's got a hat. Does he? Three already? I think so. Alan Shepard. Ah. Oh. Actually, I had a dream that I was on the moon last night. Wow. In a lunar station. It was crazy. Like, I was living on the moon, and randomly there was all sorts of Little Caesars pizza everywhere. Wow. I don't know why. <laughs> they, they, was like, <laughs> they got in early. <laughs> I really don't know why. Oh, look at this. Yes. Nice, yes. Derek. Well I, done. But I, I was had this just, expectation. I kept going I was too busy laughing. I had this expectation of space food, and all I had was <laughs> little Caesar's <laughs> pizza. I came all the way to Moon for quality Moon cuisine. <laughs> <laughs> Instead, why is it only Little Caesar's? Guys, the ball went our way. Doesn't it always? Doesn't it always? Doesn't, doesn't it always? It always. So we, oh, Center ball. Good. And score! Yeah! That's, that's a nice pass. Oh, man. Well done. Well I like done. how rewarded you are for assists in this game. Yeah. Like, 25 spot for, for just a gentle little tap. It's only one That's point for scoring. Yeah. Oh. Yes! Uh oh! Too much! No! Oh man, too much more. Or just see. enough. Or or just say. enough. It's my favorite way to it's score. <laughs> I don't know how you always manage to do it, but. Boom! <laughs> I don't, I'm not complaining. Got somebody on the corner. Thanks, Jordan. <laughs> um, man, I don't watch TV. I don't know. Have you tried watching football? <laughs> oh. Let me recommend some sports to you. Ooh. I've watched uh, Brooklyn Nine Nine recently. Oh, that's yes. So good. Oh, Brooklyn Nine Nine is so good. So funny. It's like a, it's like the best kept <clears throat> secret. Oh no. Is that oh. Shepard? No. Oh, I'm so excited. I thought it was going to be canceled, and then it got saved. Oh, maybe they scored because all three of us were right there. Could be. Yep. Could be. Clarify your canceled save comment. Oh, that, uh, it, so it was originally on Fox, and Fox dropped the show, and then NBC picked it up. That is so cool. I feel, because, I, has yeah. that happened before? Uh, literally, I think there was a, another show this, it happened to Scrubs, you mentioned. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're right. Yeah. You're right. Um, yeah. Family Guy, uh, like, was off air for years, and then came back. Yeah, like, saved by the fans, <laughs> basically. Oh! And I wish we could have done that with Firefly. Oh, right? Guys, I wouldn't put it past anything. It would not surprise me if Firefly comes back. Oh, yeah. Or, or, I mean, not at this point, probably not. At this point, Teen Titans uh, is coming back. Did you guys know that? I did not. I knew that there was a, a movie. Like no, no. That was Teen Titans Go. Teen Titans Go is huh? okay. a, like, kiddie show based on the old Teen Titans really good show. Okay. Do you remember that? Right. So the Teen Titans Go movie just came out, and, like, the mid credit scene was a trailer for oh. Teen Titans, the actual show coming back. No way. They were like, it, like the credits what? like started flipping out, and it was like, duh, 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 and they're like, all of a sudden you see Robin, and he's like, we found a way back. And then they cut to like, the like, little goofy, the, yeah, the, the, goof, the goofy little Teen Titan Go characters, and they're like, wait, who are those guys? They look way cooler. Oh, no and they're way. And like, uh, they're all like, really in on the joke, and. That's awesome. That's Oh, yeah. So excited. I love how aware, uh, like, I don't know. I, I feel like Deadpool has quite literally just affected movies and how aware they are of the movie that they are. Oh, come on. Um, 
So I think Wreck-It Ralph 2, I actually made a tweet this past weekend talking about how I think Wreck-It Ralph 2 is going to be like the Deadpool of Disney movies. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think oh, yeah, I saw so. that tweet and I thought it was clever and I think you might be right. And oh my gosh, Alan Shepard, if you score again, you're going to be so mad. Is, is Wreck-It Ralph 2 the Deadpool I won't even movies? share my little Caesar's like a, pizza a clickable, with you. <laughs> a clickable title. Well, I get it. Well, actually, I mean, Alan Shepard never got the Little Caesars. He had to stay what? Back. He had to, Alan Shepard was the guy that was stayed back in the. Uh, oh, how unfortunate for him! Oh, go in, go in, go in, go in, go in! So he didn't get to go on the moon. No, it was Buzz Lightyear oh and Neil Armstrong, and then he Buzz sat. Lightyear? Buzz Lightyear. I can't. Buzz Lightyear. Buzz, right. Lightyear. Out, uh, Buzz right. Armstrong. Dang it. Buzz Aldrin. Oh my gosh! Or, or what did I say just now? <laughs> you said Buzz Armstrong <laughs> and Buzz Lightyear. <laughs> Do oh, you no! even know no! space? <laughs> no! Oh, get, get out of here! Get it out of here! Oh, no! no! Derek, you have to turn in your NASA oh, card. I'm just, uh, this is my fault. I'm pretty sure I shot that. Oh, that was terrible. I'm sorry. All right. I am going to jump into one more question then before... You guys remember when Woody was on the moon? It's <laughs> 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 good times. Uh, this, is, this is from Ella. She Ella, opens it with saying... Ella, 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 you made that joke last time. You did. <laughs> <laughs> Ella the Umbrella Ella? The, Ella the Umbrella Ella. Yeah, um, Ella the Umbrella Ella from okay. Getting Over It. <laughs> yes. Um, she says, thanks for the action-filled outro. Here's my question. You're both very into Harry Potter and reading in general. Are you really? I was wondering I what makes a book interesting and worth the reread. I'm a young author and want to know how to... Oh, no! Oh, my Ooh, gosh. Good save, good save. we got 25 seconds to not screw this up, y'all. I think a good twist is what I'm looking for. Oh man, yeah, I think I think there's nothing better than the rereadability factor of it, where like when you go through it again and you notice all these things that were right there in front of you the first time that you didn't know. Mm -hmm. um, where it's like, oh my god, now that I know, it's like that makes so much more sense. Yup. Um, I like exposition that uh, is told, or so is shown and not told. Ah, uh, that's very true. Yeah, I don't like it. Yeah, that's, that, yeah, show that's me just good me. writing. Oof. That's why Rogue One isn't as good as the Fork Awakens. The Fork Awakens. The, the, the great, the great side Culinary. story <laughs> where Ray discovers meatballs. <laughs> <laughs> and boy, howdy, does and that Fork, fork Awaken. <laughs> There's a whole side boy, series of comics where Ray gains a lot of weight and <laughs> she has to lose it all before she go train with Luke. Jedi. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, what do you think she's really training with Luke for? <laughs> right? Oh, that's great. Oh, man. Episode 7.5. <laughs> 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 the Fork Awakens. The Fork Awakens. Oh, my gosh. I want someone to Who's just hungry? make <laughs> the, the cover art for that comic and just send it to us. That would yes. be great. Yes. Anyway, uh, guys, thank you so much for liking this video and leaving comments on it and even subscribing to the channel if you did that. That was a really cool. Remember when you did that earlier in the episode? You, like, clicked the subscribe button? That was so cool. Hey! I loved it. You're getting so much better at these. Well, apparently, like, yeah, apparently I'm not very good at it. Well, so, no, yeah, I mean, you, you're you definitely better than you once were, um, although I have to warn you that you are slowly venturing into a territory where you're using the same excited voice. No. Yeah. No. no. And so the issue is, is that, like, you don't want it to become this repeated, you know, thing. Right. Oh, my It needs goodness. to sound genuine each time. Genuine. Which is true, because you rhyme. Yeah. <laughs> when things run, they are more true. Is, <laughs> it's a known fact of life. <laughs> that is true. That is why the really big game, East Coast <laughs> is the oh, Beast Coast. Yeah. Four goals, one assist, four shots. Yeah. I yeah, feel like yeah. I was doing stuff. You were, yeah, you were getting stuff done in that game. Let's see. Are we alone at the top of the we league? Oh, we must be. Could it be? Oh, oh yeah. beautiful yeah. number. Wow. And we're playing Rebels. Rebels. Oh, we're against, we're against... Oh, man, guys, fun fact. If you go on our Patreon page, you can see an actual picture of the Rebels, Ben's 7th grade soccer team. Yes, Michael Byrne is pictured. Yeah, As is it. Devin Cook yeah. and Michael Austin. Yeah, there's like a lot of Michaels. Most of the team was Michaels. Not Michaels, yeah. It was just <laughs> yeah. like six others, too. It was really <laughs> confusing. Six, really confusing, but they were like, that's how we do. We rebel. To Mike. Uh, anyway... Until next time. Bye. Bye.